What is going on guys, this is Mr. DeLorean here, welcome back to a brand new video, and today what I'm going to do is break down the trailer for episode 5 of season 10 of The Walking Dead. This trailer has many great and like very intriguing moments or anything, but without further ado or any distractions, I'll top right into the trailer and break it down. The trailer opens with Negan washing his face and then next to a nearby lake and everything. Obviously, Negan is out because obviously last episode, near the end of the last episode, I think he was released by someone, I'm not 100% sure who, I'm pretty sure Lydia or someone else that we will see, you know, further into this trailer. But in the next shot, I think we get Brandon handing Negan a canteen and everything, saying it took me to forever, like took me forever to catch up to you and everything, signifying that Negan was possibly running. Or you know, Brandon was like you know following Negan, but Negan tried to you know like go a little bit ahead, like Brandon or whatever. But in the comics, I think this is like an exact actually replica of what like you know Brandon says to Negan or anything when Brandon does let Negan out in the comics. Because if you guys didn't know or anything, Brandon was the like the son of Tammy Rose, one of the Pike victims. And obviously, he allowed Negan or anything so he could like you know instigate a war between Rick and you know the whispers or anything so you get revenge on both sides but i feel like yet again brandon probably did let out you know negan or anything and he's you know kind of like you know catching up to him and everything and you know like giving him canteens or anything to like kind of get on his good side or anything and next we have a kind of a bit of a close-up of you know brandon or anything saying the line you know it took me a while to catch up to you and everything and stuff like that then the next couple of shots or anything they're really quick but we get some flashing shots of you know brandon and negan kind of say hanging out and the first shot or anything we get negan talking to brandon or anything i'm assuming just before they enter this like you know big warehouse place anything like if you like kind of all look off in the back like in the um like off in the distance you kind of see some walkers passing by and everything i'm assuming they're about to enter this place and then actually pretty much get negan or anything above something i'm not sure who it is or what it is it could be a walker or it could be a person or this could be negan killing brandon because i feel like i don't feel like you know brandon's gonna come out of this alive and everything or at least out of this episode alive i feel like it would be cool since i kind of do like his character a little bit and everything but i do feel it's like inevitable from him dying and then actually basically get Negan talking to Brandon or anything. It looks like they're kind of having a bit of a serious talk and everything. And Brandon's kind of breaking down a plan for him, or whatever. And Negan's looking very serious. Brandon's looking very serious. And they're kind of in this, like, you know, little truck place or this, like, you know, I don't even know what this is. It looks kind of like a motorhome. The next shot, I think we go basically back to, like, you know, the lake and everything. And Negan's smiling at Brandon, giving kind of that Negan ish smile. Like, you know, not kind of like the nice Negan or anything that we've been seeing, you know, in season nine and, you know, season 10. We're getting kind of a, like a Negan smile, like, you know, like season seven, eight, and, like, you know, like, kind of like that smile, Negan. Because this is like not a like nice Negan smile. This is a Negan smile of kind of like I will kill you and everything. I'm back to you know Negan like the killing Negan. But it's a very cool shot nonetheless. And I think we get like you know a very sinister smile from Negan. He's obviously smiling at you know Brandon or anything. Who obviously Negan thinks of oh, Brandon. You're just a dumb kid or anything. You know it's gonna happen or anything. But next we flash to a completely different you know setting with you know Kelly running through the woods and then run away from some walkers. And Kelly's 100% alone or anything in the woods. Like there's no one with her. No one to be seen with Kelly in the woods. And we see that Kelly is running away from some walkers. I think we got a shot of a walker or anything in the woods. The next couple of shots I think are very actually interesting because I do feel like actually like these shots do look very nice. I think I don't usually focus on, you know, like cinematography or anything in these like, you know, trailer breakdowns, but these shots do look like very clean, nice, and like, you know, the lighting. But we do see Kelly and everything being pinned down by a walker and everything. I do feel like this is where Kelly's going to be very, very hurt because I think there's a teaser image or a part of a teaser or anything, a shot of the teaser. It was like was released a while back or anything, but we saw Connie bringing Kelly into the hill top or anything and she was very very banged up or anything it looked like she had like gotten really really hurt so if you look off in the background anything you can see some like you know like ribbons or some shit hanging on like you know clothesline anything in the background which i'm not sure if this is like a camp or whatever that kelly found possibly and that's where all like you know the walkers came from but the next week anything we go inside the hilltop and kai's talking to i'm not sure who this character is actually but he's talking to kai i think he's highly emphasized like in this like moment or anything so i'm not sure he's gonna be like a big character or, like you know play some form of part inside this episode but i think he's talking to Kanye thinking about Kelly and everything and trying to reassure her or whatever. But then we get you see a shot, you know, Kanye looking off at the distance, very, very worried and everything. And I'm pretty sure the person is doing sign language to Connie. So obviously there's no way to really talk to Connie and everything since she is deaf. Next we get a shot of Joe and everything looking at I think of the guy and everything talking to Connie or talk like looking at Connie and everything, like going, yep, you know, like, Con like Kelly is missing. Because obviously he's giving kind of like a very serious, like I'm not sure if he is looking at the guy as like jealous or anything. I'm not sure if that's really who Dare really is to get jealous. So I think he's kind of giving a serious look to Connie going, yep, we have to go out and look for Kelly. But then next time we flash back to a completely new setting in this trailer and everything, we basically get to see the whispers in the woods. Is there anything we get to see Alpha, Gamma, and some whispers? And I'm assuming this is in like, you know, the whisper camp near Alexandria and everything, and like near the communities and everything. But we do see some whispers and everything on the ground, skinning, I think some walkers or possibly people. I don't know. I think it'd be very interesting to see the whispers kill like a person or anything. I think it'd be very interesting to see them come across a person that's not part of any of the communities or anything and just kill them. But I do feel like they're just skinning some walkers. I think that, you know, they just found. 
Next, we go to a shiny thing of Alpha, you know, like touching, like, you know, Gamma's skin or whatever, her, her face, which is really cool that we're gonna get to see them, you know, a part of this episode or part of the show and anything again ever since episode two, I think, or episode three, you know, if you count that as, you know, them together. But the next time, I think we flash to Daryl, Connie, and Dog and anything who is returning in this episode, yay. And I think I see the exact same ribbons that I did see in the background or anything of Kelly who is running around the woods or anything that got pinned down by that walk. We saw the exact same red ribbons on, you know, the trees, and we do see the exact same ones on the floor and anything and dog sniffing them out and anything so i can only assume that connie and daryl and anything and dog are looking for kelly or anything because obviously like i said earlier connie was looking very worried at daryl going yep you know something's really wrong and everything and obviously it was kelly who was missing and it's clearly like really really hurt next we get connie and daryl and anything coming up upon like a carcass and everything of what we can only assume is an animal or anything because it really doesn't look like a person but the opening minutes and anything were released or anything for this episode which i will break down eventually on this channel but for the opening minutes and anything were like a release or anything and it did show kelly like skidding or not actually skidding but killing a boar and anything and then running away because some walkers were you know coming towards it so i think this is basically like the eaten boar or whatever but the next you go back to gamma or anything who's in the woods near a lake and everything killing or like you know cutting open a walker but the next we get a very interesting shot we cut away from like you know gamma very quickly we basically see aaron looking off in the distance very confused and very kind of like ooh, what the hell is that and everything in the woods and then we flash right back to gamma who looks off in the distance or anything in the woods and i do feel these scenes are connected like aaron will see gamma in this episode which is very very interesting like i feel like you know like she'll see aaron or anything or aaron will make like a noise in the woods and gamma will look up and anything and aaron will try to hide which i feel like this is very parallel parallel to the comics or anything because i like you know negan basically tells like you know rick when he gets back to alexandria or anything in the comics saying your people that came looking for me or anything almost like you know blew my cover or anything i feel like aaron will go looking for negan or anything because obviously everyone knows negan is missing now you know from a cell and i feel like you know aaron might blow like negan's cover or whatever you know from meeting the whispers because obviously negan will meet the whispers sometime in the season it's pretty much confirmed so i feel like aaron will possibly go looking for negan you know possibly be seen by a whisper you know walk into their territory or anything and might be get like caught next we cut to alpha and everything surrounded by a ton of whispers or anything and she looks like she's giving De like you know beta a knife it's kind of really really weird how tons of whispers are staring at beta and alpha and everything like i'm not sure what the hell is happening because i'm not sure if there's gonna be any you know like tension between beta and like you know alpha or anything and that's the reason that everyone's looking at all of the whispers are looking i'm not sure maybe alpha knows knows Aaron crossed into their borders and, thing, and he's, she's telling like you know Beta to go do something about it or anything I'm not sure but you know it's just kind of weird how all that like you know whispers are staring at like Alpha and Beta or anything and, like you know Beta, Alpha's handing a Beta a knife I'm not sure what's gonna happen there but the next you know the final shot of the trailer I think is you know like Alpha talking to you know Beta yet again or anything I think that Alpha crossed Beta or anything and you know like Beta turned around I think is talking to Alpha and, like you know Alpha basically tells like like Beta and says the border will crush them or anything basically like I think this might be like you know Beta kind of like you know questioning Alpha or anything you know alpha will reassure him saying the border will crush them and there's no need to worry 100 so that was the end of the trailer and i think for episode five of season 10 of the walking dead this trailer was definitely very interesting i'm very excited to see brandon and negan like you know team up in this you know episode or anything that would definitely be very interesting do i think negan will kill brandon this episode yes and no i feel like negan might kill him and everything in the sense that you know like we got that like you know negan smile and everything like to brandon but by that very same token i feel like negan might not and everything because it might show the Alexandrians that yet again he's not changed or anything so I feel like Brandon might get killed by the whispers or get killed by a walker but you know his death will most definitely or might probably or I'm very like it's a high probability that he will die in this episode um I'm very excited to see what happens with Kelly and everything because I feel like it's very interesting to see where you know what will happen with her and I think what will make her just look very hurt what, what will hurt her because like I said in a teaser we got like you know Connie like bringing Kelly back in from like you know out in like the woods and Kelly was very 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 hurt um I'm very interested to see you know what will happen with the whispers and anything in this episode like what's been happening with the whispers ever since episode i think three i'm also very interested to see if like you know aaron will be caught by gamma or anything walking on the other side of the board because like i said those scenes were very parallel to each other like they felt very like you know connected like you know they were both in the exact same like area but, yep that was the end of the trailer i think that was the end of my discussion for the trailer and yep i hope you guys did enjoy this video make sure to like comment and subscribe what is your favorite part and anything of this trailer anything what are you most excited for in this episode but, yeah make sure to like comment subscribe or anything and make sure to like leave a review and everything if you guys are listening on iTunes. Yep, I see you guys later. Peace my amigos and peace out.